Hello and welcome to another episode of Air Gun Reviews and Hunting Channel. I've always had a soft spot for carbine style rifles and I have it in the BSA Ultra SE and I also have it in this model right here, the Walter Rotex RM8. in 2.2 caliber. Let me read you some uh, specs on this particular rifle. It's made in Germany. It has a Manili style stock on it, beach stock. It has Double raise uh, cheek piece, ambidextrous stock, vented rubber butt pad. Comes with two eight round magazines. Optics is my uh, favorite scope. O'Hunt, 414 by 44. Side focus. Got an aftermarket larger bolt knob, a plug that goes underneath for the refill the, put the faucet fitting in it. On the bottom is your manometer, a nice spot for that. I love the checkering on this uh, wood stock, on the forearm and on the hand grip right here. It's very nice checkering. It does have a 200 cc bottle. The rifle is regulated. Let me read you uh, some specs about this particular gun. Okay. It has a two-stage adjustable match trigger, dovetail, 11 millimeter dovetail mounts. It's got a manual safety back here. Can be filled to 232 bar or 3,365 PSI. On the end here, I have a TKO moderator. And I put the carbon fiber cover over the barrel. What is, let's see. It is the barrel length is 19.669 inches overall length. 41. I already said it's got a eight shot capacity magazine. The, the rifle does weigh in at eight pounds with this beach stock. You can order these from Pyramid Air. They're currently out of stock. But it's just something about this rifle. It just, you can see it's, it's a quality piece. Very accurate. This is definitely not a hundred yard gun, but for 60 and in, it is very accurate. I did a video testing with this particular gun back in uh, January. But anyways, it's shooting 15.89 uh, grain at 18, almost 19 uh, foot pounds of energy. Average velocity is 730 feet per second. 
If ES extreme spread is 26, standard deviation of six, it gets 32 shots or four magazines. That's what the gun puts out. And I don't have a problem with the gun. We're gonna go ahead and test the trigger on this gun. So let's do that. First stage hits the wall. One pound, three ounces. Not a bad gun. Some people may say it's heavy. I say it's not, but that's me. But very pliable. Comes right up to the shoulder, just fine. It's a very nice gun. I added the swivel stud in the back and one up front for a bipod or another swivel stud up here so I could uh, use a sling. But overall, it's a nice gun. That's my review on my Walter Rotex carbine and 22 caliber. Till next time, folks. Shoot straight and may your pellet hit his target. We'll see you in the next episode.